Greetings everybody, Scully here, welcome you back to our free-to-play challenge run of Star Wars The Old Republic. Uh, a couple of comments from Xylent, I sure appreciate you buddy, you've helped me out a lot. Uh, he wanted to remind me that if you sign up for the security key, you can get more cartel coins. And they give you, uh, he says 100, I didn't actually check on this, but he says 100 cartel coins every month. And all you have to do, I did check up on this, all you have to do is sign up for security key and there's a free app that you can put on your if you have like an iPhone or an iPad you can put that on there and like I said it's a hundred cartel coins every month so that that would help somebody out that needed unlocks uh, what was the other thing he wanted me to check up on our Tukata lore for Korriban and that is in the codex entry beast series and we do have it right here Tukata so I appreciate you for double checking up on that though, buddy. That that does help me out. Uh, for now, we've got a lot of killing to do. I want to send my companions out and make sure that we're getting all that done. And let's do these up here. These are orange. I'd hate to I'd hate to send them out down here on these green ones because we might not get points for it. It's kind of random. Your confidence is not misplaced. A task just for you. And oh, thank you, master. Our inventory is looking pretty skittish, so we'll have to we'll have to watch that. It'll get better here in a little bit, though. Boom. When we get a chance, let's talk. Okay, when we get a chance, we'll talk. Just not for a long time. And there's one thing I should probably cover over the companion gifts. I probably should have done this from day one. Um, as I'm hovering over it, if you look at that red text, and it might be too small for you to see, if I click on this, it says that it, uh, Vet's reaction is a small influence gain. That means that she's not going to get very much. This one over here will give her a moderate. But if uh, whenever Quinn gets back, I'll show you what his reaction would be. There's another small, another small. This one right here, she won't get any influence from that, so I don't want to give that to her. I'd rather give that to another companion. And I think I did cover this part. Uh, let me get in some combat here. I think I did cover this part, but um, the reason I don't want to talk to my companions right now and do that quest, I'd rather do them all at once. And from reading on the various websites, it's a good idea to save that until you get up there because the amount of influence you get from talking to them doesn't go up or down. It's kind of like a flat rate. Whereas if I give her... Uh, where's a gift I can give her? We'll give her this one right here. If I give her this gift, and it says small influence. Hey, It's thanks. a level one gift. She got 26 influence. If I was to give that to her when she was, say, influence level 40, she might only get 5 or 6 influence points from that. So that's something to take into consideration if you care about that. Me right now, I'm more worried about inventory space, so as long as she's getting something from it, I'll go ahead and give it to her. So yeah, just to kind of backtrack on that, uh, I would give them gifts before I actually do the conversations for two reasons. Reason one being I want to do all the conversations at once because I like to see them back to back. And reason two, I believe you will actually get more influence for that conversation if you hold off on it until they're a higher level. And do I need to do any more killing? No, I think we turn it in now. Oh, we gotta overload the circuits. Okay, two more of those. Uh, money. I really should be going back to the fleet and seeing if there's something I can buy, but uh, I don't really want to waste any more time. Uh, 
Oh boy, look at that. Our first epic. And we've done a lot of looting too. What is it? That is... Oh wow, and that's... That's not bad. We'll go ahead and... Mm, I'm going to save that for right now. I kind of want to see if one of my other companions will benefit more from it. Delivered, Master. If I die, I'm going to haunt you. Okay, send a robot back out. Oh, nice. We don't even have to go for training. That's cool. If you think that's the best use of me. Well, there's more money I don't have to worry about. I don't have to worry about going back to the fleet to buy training for that. And I believe on this particular fight, if you're a low level, you might want to go ahead and make sure that you've got some form of a CC. Because I remember this guy used to deal pretty good damage back in the day. Yeah, he's a strong. So we'll go ahead and give him a force choke. And then we'll lay into him. Interrupt his ability. And go turn it in. As well as clean up our inventory a bit. We'll get what I can do is get rid of all the level one um Oh, what do they call it? Level 1 gifts. And from now on, we're only getting level 2. And then once we hit level 3, I'll give them all the level 2 gifts. That way I'm not stopping all the time because they do stack up. And let's find a vendor real quick. Please use all products only as intended. Don't need that, and I think all these are gifts. That we don't need. That's a crafting material. Mm, I hate to do this. I I'm pretty sure I can buy it later if I really, really wanted to. Well, you know what? It requires... Yeah, it requires something we don't have. So I'm going to go ahead and get rid of it. And as far as that goes, I said I was saving that one. Any more of these that can stack? Not yet. Be well. I might actually end up deleting these because we just... I don't need them. I, well, actually, I'm going to wait because these might affect influence. I want to find that out before I do that. So let's go ahead and give her whatever we can. That's no influence. There's a small influence. This is great. Thanks. I'd be better off seeing if my other companion would get this more. This is great. Thanks. But... For the sake of keeping this quick, I'm just gonna go ahead and hey, thanks. give her all these. Hey, thanks. Except that one. I will save that one. Wow, I love it. No influence. No influence. No influence. And no influence. Okay, let's get busy. How long did we have on him? Thirty seconds. Cool. Thirty seconds. We'll bring him back out. Let's take the speeder. And I will fast forward it to the next station. Travel route is confirmed. Okay, so he came back with medical supplies, and I don't want medical supplies. But I don't really have a choice. If you think that's the best use of me. The plan is to head down here. We're going to knock this right here out. And double check. There might be... I think there are some more quests right in this area where that speeder's at. I keep forgetting we have a bike.
Ooh, I almost ran right off that. Uh, I will probably do that in one of these episodes. Alright, we will go ahead and take out a few of these guys. That might start a quest chain. And it didn't. So our supplies are in here. Oh, there used to be a quest for that. Maybe it comes later. Alright, so now we need to destroy some stuff. More barrels. And I knew I was forgetting something in that last episode. Um, let me see. If you notice, I target this guy, and I'm over here clicking my mouse, and I cannot untarget him. If that bothers you, there is an option. And I'll tell you what, let me take a break, and I will find it, and I'll let you guys know. Okay, that option I was talking about was really easy. It's under controls and deselect target upon clicking on terrain. So I'll go ahead and apply that. And all that does is I've got him targeted and say I don't want to target him. I can just click off of it. So that is an option for those that want it. Yeah, I don't remember. I think I was doing an escort or something. And I was trying to figure out how to, how to get off her off the target. And there's a chest. Let's go ahead and get it. Ready for your next order. Oh, he got the hill off. And pull out Quinn here for just a minute. No, that's not what I want to do. Later. My lord. And come back in here and see what we can give him. See, right here it says uh, we get a large influence with him, and Vet didn't get any. So I'm going to go ahead and give these to him to up his influence. I am overwhelmed, my lord. I am overwhelmed, my lord. I am overwhelmed, my lord. You have my thanks. I like the reactions. I am overwhelmed, my lord. You have my thanks. I am overwhelmed. And we won't be doing that anymore now that we're at uh we're getting rank two gifts. And those will stack up, so let's call out Vet. Until you need me again. Hey. We're looking for ammo caches and guns and what else? Barrels. This always does the trick. So we can get around that guy. Awesome. There might be some barrels up there. Oh, there's some. And there's another two more turrets.
that should be the last turret. Alright, just need one barrel and two more ammo crates. Like I said, oh, there's barrels. If I can get it without aggroing that NPC over there. Already killed him in the Let's Play, I remember that. I'll run up here and see if there's more barrels. <clears throat> or crates, sorry. Nope, just barrels. What about in here? Nope. Might be some up here. Come on, bring it. There's one right there. You got me. You think you scare me? I don't think there's any more, though. Oh, right there. Last one. Awesome. Okay, what do we have now? Looks like all those get turned in. Well, let's do it. Actually, let's just quick travel right to there. That would be a lot quicker. There she is. The rebels' facilities have been destroyed. I heard the fireworks from here, my lord. Nothing like the smell of rebels roasting on their own blasted suitcase bombs. And might as well sell while we're here. Do you require medical attention? Get rid of that because I don't want it. And don't really need the stems. Crafting materials, and we're not doing this stuff. Be well. Yeah, what do we have left? Hmm. Okay, let's take the speeder. Well, choices, choices. Let's go up north. Well, no, no. Going to the speeder. And Explain I'm headed, all authorized destinations. headed to Vanguard Outpost. I'll catch up with you guys when we get there. Travel route is confirmed. And I'm not seeing what I want to see yet. I'm going to keep on going because I want to check up on a data pad over there. There should have been like at least one more quest right there. 
And there should have been one somewhere down right here. So I'm not not done with this area yet. I'll keep on looking. That may be part of the bonus series that I'm thinking of, which we will get to here eventually. Yeah, because he has us uh, come over here and kill some guys. Let's check up on the data pad, though. Got the data pad, that'll work. Come in, Torsen. This is headquarters. Lieutenant Torsen, please respond. Sir, we've got something. What? Lieutenant Torsen, is that you? Blast it, Nauto. Get me a clear visual. That's better. Oh. Apologies, my lord. I didn't recognize you. I... Is there a lieutenant by the name of Torsen with you by any chance? What's the situation here? Torsen's squad was deployed to recapture that region's farmsteads. The resistance is desperate for supplies, pushing to capture every food source available. I hope to retake the farms and put their crops to our use. That's no longer an option. We have to destroy the crops on those farmsteads. We cannot allow the enemy access to such a valuable resource. You're already in the area. Can you help us? I'll sleepwalk through it. Torsen's squad was carrying a set of RK-9 soil devastators for this contingency. They'll be on the soldiers' bodies. Once you have the soil devastators, fight past the resistance patrols and position them in the growing fields. The devices will blight the soil beyond all use. If you could, contact me again when the objective is complete. Good luck to you. And make sure he's running a quest. If you think that's the best use of me. Loot this body on the ground. And up here, just click on that. While you're in the middle of the garden. You don't even have to stand there, just click it and run. C205. Click it and go. I like that. I'm pretty sure it's probably a bug in the game. I'm sure they intended for you to actually have to stand there. Four out of five, need one more garden. I think it's over there. How close is that money getting? 177, man, we are getting so close. Ooh, I almost missed that one. The quest right there. Well, that wouldn't have been good to have to come back to this planet just for that one quest. It's a data pad on the table, yep. Did she really just... Wow. She just killed the entire group with one hit. Alrighty, so we still need one more garden. The 
They kind of look like pumpkin patches, I guess. I don't know. Let me get, get down there and have a look at it. This always does the trick. Yeah, I'm not really sure what they are. Kind of looks like a pumpkin with a root growing out Task of it. Is complete. All right, so set that off. Yeah, there was a guy. I should have killed him. All right, defeat resistance patrons. I think those guys are over here. Not those guys. Well, let's mount up and see if we can find them. I think it was the guy that was inside. There we go. No, it's not these guys. You think you scare me? There we go. Probably should have used the cooldown. He did quite the number on me. Alright, did we knock it out pretty good? We need to go back over there and turn that in. Your confidence is not misplaced. And inventory. Oh, uh, yeah, we're doing good now. As long as I'm not looting a whole bunch of greens, I'll be in trouble. Oh boy. Ah! Good, I better blow a cool down because we're going to be hurting. You know, with that being said, I think I will go ahead and heal up. That's a little too close to death there. Alright, that's good. Data pad on the ground over here. Ah, hello again. Scans show the soil devastators in full operation. Excellent. Thank you for taking the time to assist us. The operation would have failed without you. I'm pleased to have served. I've arranged for a small token of my gratitude to be sent to you. Thanks again. Yeah, we are, what, 11 levels above what we should be? What was, I think Tatooine was level 25 or 26, so... We are way ahead of the experience curve. That's, I guess that's what happens when you do everything there is to do in a game. But the game will get harder probably around, I'd say, level 40. 40, 45, whenever we start hitting those type of territories, it'll start getting harder when uh, the enemies catch up to us in levels. Master Pantillo, target's preparing to move out. But you still refuse to attack! My men are corporate security, sir. We can't defeat Republic commandos in a fair fight. Then, you're fortunate I see one last option, Master Sith. Maverse Pontillo of the Pontillo Foundation. Pardon me for speaking out of turn, but I have a proposition. What sort of proposition? I am, I was, a businessman. I supported the Empire when this war began, both in and out of the boardroom. The Republic sent a squad to kill me. They botched the mission, killed my wife and daughter. So my mercenaries tracked the commandos responsible. 
We lured them from their base with a distress call, but they came ready for a trap. We can't afford... I can afford anything. So since my men refuse to strike, I'll pay you to murder every squad member who took part in the attack on my family. Like it or not, innocents die in war. Murdering these soldiers won't bring your family back. No. But it would be only fair. The commandos are scouting those polluted wastes. I'll need proof of their deaths. Blood. Dog tags. I don't care. But kill them. Make things right. Yeah, I think that one's actually upstairs. And I figured out what I'm going to do about the mailbox. Uh, I'm going to do every planet, but I will go through and make sure that we don't have any uh, spam in there before I show it on camera. I can go in, delete all the spam, and... Oh, where is this thing? Is it... Oh, downstairs in the tent. My lord, you honor me with your presence. How may I serve you? I found all the bodies in the village, Captain. Don't deny that you're the one responsible. You, I, I, I assure you, this is all just a, just a misunderstanding. The villagers, you see, they deceived us. They, they ambushed us, and we had to kill them. No impropriety, nothing personal in what happened. I simply did my duty. We can keep this simple, can't we? You can forget whatever it is you think you saw, and I can forget about leaving these credits sitting on my desk. Agreed? Turn yourself in, or I'll take matters into my own hands. You. Leave me no choice, then. So be it. Colonel Aiden, this is Captain Varmet. Yes, Captain. I wasn't entirely truthful when I told you what happened with the supply drop-off. And what do we have left? Retrieve the ID cards. Man, I'm almost positive there's at least one more quest in this area that I'm missing. I'm thinking I picked it up, like, right here. So... Well, let me look at the map. I guess we'll go down here and clear this out and clear that out and see what else is left. I'll do some off-camera legwork, see if I can figure that out, and we'll consider that planet complete later on. Yeah, I'll just I'll I'll do some off-camera legwork, see what I can come up with on that particular quest. Cause it was to come out here and deal with these guys. Well, we might get lucky. It might actually be part of the bonus series, which we re we haven't started yet. That one right there. This isn't good. If I die, I'm going to haunt you. Walked right into that. Don't hit me. Nice. We got away with that one. This should be to kill these guys right over here. This always does the trick. All right, so we need eight more.
somebody else. Oh, I hate this stupid bug. Nice, she finished him off. You know, there was a guy that's bugged out. I don't know if he's in a building or what, but he's like right down in that area. I can't believe they haven't fixed that one. That one's been there, I don't know, probably day one. And where does that turn into? All the way back over there? Let's quick travel. I'm gonna. Oh, well, we can't quick travel. Alright, we will just ride. What was that, five minutes? That's alright. We will need, be needing that eventually, anyways. It should be ready when we go up here. Then we can quick travel to turn it back in. And I probably need to send my companion out again. Yep. Right away. And how is our inventory? Doing good. We haven't really gotten any loot since uh quite a while. One piece of gray item. Two gray items. Let's swap that out. Almost there. It's really done, isn't it? The men who killed my family. You've made them pay. The names. The names match the dog tags. They're dead. All dead. Go home now, Captain. My wife and daughter are avenged. I'll have the men prepare for departure, sir. It's not as satisfying as I expected. Perhaps I should see whether those Republic soldiers had families. Justice has been served. You won't gain anything by murdering more. You may be right. I'll think on what you've said. You've done well for me. Take your reward. Farewell. And we're gonna hop on this speeder and hit up, head up north. Displaying all authorized and destinations. And we'll fast forward it. Our destination is right over in here, and I believe there's a data pad right there. Travel route is confirmed. Okay, uh, let's go ahead and mount up. Our data pad should be just over this hill. Or maybe the next hill. Right around where the water is. The task is complete. Thank you, sir. Well, let's give you another one. Your confidence is not misplaced. And we'll go ahead and send the robot on it as well. Perfection is my goal, master. And how is our light side doing? It's crawling up there. Got another 1,400 to go. Boom. Looks 
Looks like we have some killing to do as well. This is Lieutenant Zack Hill, 83rd Platoon. It's my final duty to report mission failure. My squad had orders to recover stolen Imperial data card from resistance fighters. Recovery complete, but my men suffered extensive injuries. Ambushed by Republic patrol. Many men too injured to run. Wouldn't leave them. <laughs> Not to those animals. We stood our ground, called for air support, but the enemy must have jammed our signal. Republic scum slaughtered my men, shot the wounded where they lay, and left me for dead. The enemy stole the data card. They now possess codes to open any Imperial security door on Balmora. I accept full responsibility. Should have run when we had the chance. Overheard them mention a computer at their outpost. Taking the coded data card there for decryption. If reinforcements find this message. Recovery of stolen coded data card. Maximum priority. Find Republic outpost. Retrieve coded data card. Return to Captain Lama at our forward base. He'll know what to do. I will bring the Republic to its knees. Lieutenant Zack Harrell. Signing off. And we need three of these guys. Three more. One more. Oh boy, there goes my mouse. And the data pet or whatever we need should be right there. Do a leap of faith here. Yeah, if you're fighting those guys, don't fight them in that toxic water right there. Try to fight them on the ground if you can. Uh, I think it's right. Hmm. I thought it was right here. I guess it's over here. There's the lore object for those that missed it in our walkthrough. Unable to achieve optimal results, my lord. Oh. Okay, yeah, I know where this is. This is right about here. We actually killed that in the walkthrough, if you remember that. The results are much better than they appear, Master. You'll see. Yeah, see, it says, it says that she's down here. I've never seen one down here, but I know for a fact there is one over here, and I mentioned it in, the, I mentioned it in our walkthrough. We're after the stolen data card. Looks like it's probably right there. Let's go ahead and knock a few of these guys out. Come on, bring it. Anything else I need to do over here other than the mother? Yep, need to locate the shuttle straight ahead. And that's kind of in the same spot, actually. We'll go over here and kill the mother first. Show you guys where it is on the map, but if you followed the playthrough, you should already know this. She's right here. And on the big map, we'll show that as well. 
And that is for clean up the waste to kill a Zeldert mother. Boom. That one's done. Let's get our shuttle. Now this one's got a little bit of a little bit of RNG to it. Uh, he'll die eventually. And we're running around. There it is. There's the data pad. Let's kill this guy. Yeah, this part has a little bit of RNG. We're looking for space parts, spaceship parts. And when you find them, it's not a hundred percent guarantee that it's going to update your quest. You might have to go find another one. Like, see, there's one over there as well. Space, de space debris. There's nothing there, so we'll run over here and see if we can find some. Nothing there. There's one over there. Usually a third time's the charm. Nothing there either. Okay, on to number four. There's one right there. I don't think I've ever gone past three, so it's kind of a stretch here. Wow, really game? I don't I don't care for this much RNG. Come on, please. We found it. Seal container bearing an Imperial biohazard symbol. I think that's everything in this area. So we will go ahead and teleport down to here and then we'll fly down to there. I was dead when I found him. He hid the bioweapon, but I dug it up. Poor Republic. All that trouble for nothing. At any rate, congratulations. I'll include a full description of your heroics in my report. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must see to the bioweapon safe transport off Balmora. Okay, and I will... Oh, nice. One right there. Colonel Prussian. Yes, my lord. We've been expecting you. This army the Resistance has gathered. We're losing the last battle of the war, and manpower isn't our problem. But Darth Lacris promises you can help, and I've learned to trust her judgment. How long have you worked for the Darth? My division worked under her during the occupation of Varsid, street to street fighting for the Emperor's glory. I've asked my men to identify priority Resistance targets for you. You'll move at your discretion, and we'll supply you with anything you need. And be careful if you stray into the toxic areas of the valley. We're receiving a report of some sort of insectoid infestation. Even the resistance stays clear. Understand, Colonel. The resistance is doomed. In the name of the Emperor and Darth Lacris. Alright, so I'm going to speed down to the other one. 
Let's talk. And see you guys when we get there. Travel route is confirmed. Okay, I think this might just be a drop box. No, it says report. Oh, that's right. Oh, upstairs. <laughs> Excuse me. I will get that quest in a minute. That might actually be one of the ones I wanted. Captain Labber, 83rd Platoon. I'll do my best to serve, my lord, though my resources are limited. One of my squads disappeared while returning from an important mission. I'm mounting a search and rescue operation. A hollow recording from your squad leader directed me here, Captain. Hollow recording? I don't understand. Wait. That data card you're holding. I recognize those markings. That's the security codes the traitor stole. I sent Lieutenant Haral's squad to recover that there. They didn't make it, did they? They fought bravely, but they were outnumbered by Republic forces. I served with Lieutenant Haral for six years. This must not stand. It's time to burn every Republic outpost to the ground. Show those dogs how the 83rd platoon avenges its fallen. I'll organize what's left of my command and drive those scum off Balmora by myself if I have to. Lieutenant Heral stood his ground when he should have retreated. Heral was one of the best I've served with. But you're right. We need a solid plan of attack. It's good you retrieved that data card. If the Resistance had cracked our security codes, their saboteurs and commanders could have struck where we're most vulnerable. A Sith is honor bound to serve. You've done the 83rd Platoon and the Empire a great honor. I wish I could offer a greater reward, but I'm afraid this will have to do. I should file a report with Central Command. I appreciate your wise counsel, my lord. Good day. And let's get those companions to working. No gifts. That if you think that's the best use of me. Perfection is my goal, master. And we need to go all the way down there. I think it's this speeder right here. It's kind of hard to tell. Displaying all authorized destinations. We'll we'll go ahead and go to this speeder right here. Travel route is confirmed. See you guys when we get there. There's a quest right off the bat. That looks like a, yep, flashpoint. And am I in the right spot? We are. Uh, travel. Quick travel is just not going to be ready soon enough. We're going in here to investigate the cave. Come on, bring it. Twenty-five forces, wow.
ready for your next order. Alright, so we're in here to use this terminal. I'm here. What do you need, Amber Carter? Hold on. How did you get in? I can be very persuasive. All right, I can take a hint. Listen, the people in that complex aren't of any consequence and are certainly no threat to the Empire. They have quite an escort for people of no military value. Try again. I'm telling the truth. They're Force Sensitives, and the law on Imperial planets is all Force Sensitives must be trained as Sith. If you don't train, you're executed as a potential threat, but not everyone would make it as a Sith. Some people discover their sensitivity when they're too old, or they just don't have the will. So they go into hiding with us. What would you do with these washouts? What would anyone do? We take them to Republic planets, get them a job farming dirt or making hyperdrives or whatever. But the Emperor keeps making laws that say they have to die. If they are no threat, they have little to fear from me. Are you serious? Your superiors would... Well, I won't tell them if you don't. Everyone in that cavern will have you to thank for their lives. We'll clear everyone out of the caves. It would be best if you could say you found nothing here. Yeah, it would probably be best for both parties if I keep my mouth shut on that. Alright, we got finally got a companion gift. is not misplaced. Leave everything to me, Master. I will not disappoint you. And I do believe we are done here. What area is this? K-52. Yep, yeah, we are done here. That is a lot of killing. This always does the trick. There's hardly even that many around, but they should spawn pretty fast. Seven more. All right, we need one more. Oh, I didn't even see this. That's our delivery, I guess. Your Tyrus is operative, correct? Good to see you alive. Major? Yes, I'm here with your operative. He secured the tunnels. No, I contacted you immediately, sir. He wants to know if you made it in time. Cave 52 has no cargo. They moved whatever it was before I entered. Sir? Uh, we've got dust. Uh-huh. I'm certain, sir. He's cursing about Imperial intelligence again. You may want to sit down. This usually takes a while. Sir? 
Yes, sir. I'll pass the word on. He apologizes for the unnecessary danger. It looks like our battalion is going to be searching the other caves. I have completed my task, then. We'll find their nerve center soon enough. And when we do, they'll pay. You, on the other hand, are in the Major's good books. He wants to commend you for aiding the battalion. If every soldier we had risked their neck like you, this empire would be a much different place. And get the last kill we need. Wow, level 34. Good grief. Those levels are just creeping up there too fast. Okay, that is all the way over here. Oh, that was part of a heroic. Yeah, I don't want to do that right now. I knew that was a lot of killing for some reason. So we're going to untrack that and hook back up our... Bonus, where is it? Bonus series, right there. That's going to be quite a ways away. Yeah, that is all the way over there, and I don't have a quick travel, so I'll tell you what, we'll go ahead and, well, let me get to a safe spot. I still need to find a Bormu. I think I've got a pretty good idea where one of them's at. So we will go ahead and end the video here, and next time we'll be working on that uh, bonus series. Hope everybody's having a great time, and we'll Scully signing out.